Good God. So a few hours later, we finally made it. We're out here in like, I don't know, I would say maybe South Central, I guess. We went to another park, but it was really, really busy and it's kind of a small park. So we decided to come over here. I'm not too sure. I'll get the name of the park for you guys for sure. A little bit of obstacles on the ground. Not bad. Let's see what we got. It's looking pretty dope. Nice. We've got a nice little wall right here. Some ledges. Some crazy looking do your do it yourself section in the back maybe. Some stairs. Alright. Looking pretty dope. Oh, excuse me guys. Good save. Yeah, let's see what we got today. Alright guys. A little warmed up. It's looking pretty dope. Like I said, always be aware of your surroundings at the park. That way you know who's coming your way. Oh yeah, this kid's good. This little two block, pretty legitness. Big stairs over here. right there what a nice skateboard solid Almost at it. I think the pebble or that thing. A little faster, a little faster. Shit was chill. We're on our way to get some tacos and we're gonna party tonight like it's 1995. Rave stop, baby. Taco location found. What is this? Tacos Los Guichos. We're over here in South Central off of Slauson Street. Yeah, is that Mexico City? Uh, El Centro, Defe. Centro Federal. So, District Federal. So, it's gonna be like Authentic tacos and someone just got shot. Awesome. We're definitely in the right place. Oranges off the side of the freeway. <laughs> you know it's gonna be good food out here, guys. Not right by Yanteria, next to the tire spot. Oh yeah, that's the stuff right there. That's what I'm talking about. See also. That's like the best cut of the meat you're gonna find out here, guys. Trust me. It's gonna be super tasty. Super cool. So basically, you get your tickets. They give you a special ticket. You give it to the man over there making the little trompa with all the delicious al pastor style cut meat, which is like a marinated pork. Very delicious, authentic food. Let's see how good it is. There's a lot of places that have different types of food in their... Uh, well, everyone claims to have the best authentic al pastor. So we'll see. This place I've never had before, but it was rated number one in the area we were in right now. So 
Let's see how good they are. I can see you got four, so. I got a molita and I got two, so I had to get the tacos for sure. As you can see, all the delicious meat is stacked up, layered, intricately woven, perfectly all aligned in order to get the best flavor, the best meat drippings, all of that just comes down. And of course, you gotta have some really high heat to go with the tacos in order to get the real crisp on the side, so you can see right there. Uh, this is kind of like a Middle Eastern style cooking as well. They have it with the shramas and stuff. So there's a ticket, you give it to the man, taco man gets your stuff you get your order ready he calls you literally takes like because it's constantly going it takes a couple seconds these girls got there right after us and got the taco at the same time i think i got my food as well already the homie was hustling hard so you already know i guess he had to buy a bag of oranges <laughs> It's always good to support the community. You already know, we're gonna grow up good. Let's see how good these tacos are, my man. Oh, that post is seeing better days. Agustin's already grubbing, so that's dope. We're gonna get right into it. He likes it, but he got different meat, right? He ended up getting pastor, I believe. Asada, sorry, pastor was the one that you saw and that's like, I'm guessing the most popular cut of meat that I have there. The drippings are nice. So it looks plain. Not bad. They give you sauce. Green sauce, red sauce, red sauce. No limes, which I prefer limes with it, but whatever. Hopefully you guys can see it. Your are... Oh yeah, I got limes over here. Just kidding. Because I did get it something else. I got another item too. I got a torta. So I'll show you what that looks like in just a moment. I love Murita. Murita, sorry, which is a little... It's like a, uh, a little doughy type of uh, like taco, cheese taco, I would say. There you go, sorry. Deliciousness, gotta get, there you go. Gotta get that lime in there. Let's see, first impressions. Anytime I go anywhere, cheese tacos are my favorite to get. Mmm. Taco, pretty spicy, but the taste, Some nice tender pork. Mmm. Pretty good. But I gotta take you guys to another spot. In the hood as well. These are way tastier. I like the ones with the beans in it, but these are really, really good. I hope you guys enjoyed these little taco bits. We're gonna show you guys right now the molita, which is a really fatty, but very filling dish. Hopefully you guys like it. There you go, guys. Our pastor. Looking pretty tasty. Plain Jane. Good tender cuts. Nice. That's right, guys. You can't forget the grilled onions or sautéed peppers. Every time you sauté the peppers, they bring out a little bit of extra spice. Can't forget the red radish. You gotta have that crunch with that texture as well. Look at this, guys. It's looking so good, so cheesy. Oh, yeah. So we had to switch it up for the green sauce and the red sauce. It's a little too vinegary for me, but not bad at all. And look at this, guys. Look at that cheese stretch. Not bad at all, right? Even though we did walk across the street, I prefer my little gordita, a little more meltier, a little more griddled up, so it's nice, crispy shell. But nonetheless, not too bad. Let's see what it tastes like. First impressions are everything. So let's see. Oh, yeah. That was a nice hearty bite. Very tasty, nice, salty, savory. Gotta have that pepper. Not too spicy, okay. Oh yeah, nice sweet sauteed onions. Gotta have the onions, makes a nice fire taste. Complements everything, and of course, that crunch. Like I said, red radishes are a must. In Mexico or any place you go to, they always have the Coke bottles, so. I don't drink sodas anymore, but I highly recommend yourself you get yourself a nice Coke bottle, pop that bad boy open, enjoy yourself one of these dudes, and you won't be upset. So, thank you guys for enjoying that little snippet of the food. Let's keep going. We're going to party hard tonight.
whole setup right here. And it's all a prop. What a waste. Get him, no bag. Sick boy. We're on our way back. We're gonna go back home, get ready for tonight. We're gonna have a little surprise party. For my homegirl Jasmine. It's gonna be exciting. Ooh. See you guys in a bit. We just made it in time. We gotta get inside before the birthday girl gets here. Uh, you hear some ruckus. Right here, guys. Right Shut your ass up, boy! Yo, what's up, fool? I'm not smacking. Hi, guys! Hey, what's up? Oh, I love you. This is my buddy Raymundo. Hey, what's up? Hi, Teo. Let's get it, guys. Club Jasmine is about to commence. And some boy. What happened? How are we doing it? This is how we're doing it. It's gonna be a wonderful weekend, y'all. Surprise party for my homegirl Jasmine. We got the whole gang in the house. It's gonna be great. All right.
it up with the brown and the white. That's Rihanna, y'all say that's a, that's a re-re, that's a quee-quee.